never said I'd go with you. Ugh, I smell a side quest. Business in the delusion scape? Please be well prepared. This shop sells all kinds of odd. Okay, we're here. Right. So you go wait over there. What? No, I've got some stuff I want to check out too. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? We're at Wands. Isn't shopping the whole reason we're here? Not we. Just me. What? But you're totally still having me hold your bags, aren't you? How is that fair? All right. Time for some crepes. Crepes? A bit too sweet, but I suppose it will have to do. Uh, Ko? What? Where's mine? I mean, I know my hands are full and all, but... Oh, you wanted one too? Seriously? I've never heard of anyone wanting to eat crepes alone. Well, you're in luck then, because you have now. It's a new life experience you didn't know you'd have today. I don't want a new life experience. I want a crepe, damn it! Okay then, off we go. What? You want to go dangle more carrots in front of me now? Jeez, at least give me a chance to catch up. Or you could just move faster. We're going to the side streets next. Man, I really wanted a crepe too. What urgent business do you have now? It's right in front of you. I'm going to Rakos. Rakos? Isn't that like a cosplay shop? Ooh, are you gonna... I'll thank you not to jump to conclusions. I'm just looking for new clothes, nothing more. Aww. What manner of perversion were you imagining that twisted little head of yours? Nothing, not a thing. Huh? What? What's going on? You didn't buy anything. I never said I would. I said I was going to look for new clothes. Oh, come on. Shopping in general was already a stretch, but how does window shopping qualify as urgent business? It just does. How? It's something somebody said to me once. Back to the real world, the true world. A world where there are lots and lots of fun things just waiting for us. Like crepes, so delicious. And you can buy all sorts of things from these quaint little stores with cute owners. If you wanted, 
We could even go look at clothes together, and... Actually, it's nothing. Never mind. Co? Look, can you just carry my bags? Will you stop running off without me? We upgrade our PPs while we're here. I'm certain this is right near where I ran into that pink caped man. Well, it doesn't look like he's here now. Think he's some sort of performer who shows up on schedule? I don't know. I think you might have the wrong place. Just a feeling I have. I have a feeling that you are an annoying little rodent. Are you doubting my memory? What did you just call me? Knock it off, you two. We're all friends here. Do you remember what he said to you when you met, Ko? Well, let's see. You have the right to see your dreams become reality. All you need is to wish, and your desires will come to pass. Stuff like that. It all sounded like some sort of cheap scam to me. Do you recall when it was that you met with him? Oh, I'll never forget. It was right after I spoke with a particularly rude man on the street. Are you by any chance referring to... Yes, you. It was that night I ran into you outside of Radio Lakaikon. That night, once I got home, I started thinking, trying to figure out what in the hell a delusion contractor was. Then all of a sudden, that dull world was born. And before I knew it, I'd gone inside. So meeting with Cannon is most likely what created the delusion, then. It all checks out. Then maybe we should check in at Violet Eden and see if we can make sense of any of this. Akemi might have some new information for us by now, too. Yeah, sounds good to me. Let's go. This shop sells PP parts. Shall we take a look? An event is about to start. Perhaps we should drag our feet a bit. Something smells great. Even needs get hungry, huh? What's that supposed to mean? Mm. Was that? The cry of my hungry stomach. Seriously, that was a stomach growl? But it was so cute. Creepy. Did you want to get something to eat, Mippity? 
There's an awesome beef bowl place right around here. 